My, my first real foray into 9-11 truth was uh, at the Truth Emergency Convergence in Washington, D.C., July 22 and 23 at American University. And uh, my brother and I were the, the, uh, the music there. And that's where I got that book, David Ray Griffin's book. Somebody gave that to me. And another guy, David Schlesinger, came up to me and he said, you should do a song about William Rodriguez. Do you know who that is? And I said, is he the janitor that was rescuing people and then was even dined at the uh, White House? And they tried to make him a Republican candidate. And he refused all that. He refused to change what he saw. Yeah, that's the guy. He says, I have his phone number. Here it is. Call him up, interview him, and see if you can write a song. So I just got an assignment. And this is the song. It was a beautiful September morning Now everyone remembers that date World Shades and a worker William Rodriguez was lucky to be coming in late He'd been clocking into his janitor job For 20 long years, don't you know He'd even survived the 93 basement bombing that injured a thousand or so. As he walked into the maintenance office, right down there on sub-level one, his buddy Felipe stormed in the room, screaming in panic and pain he did run. When a fiery blast from the elevator shaft Burned the skin off his face and his arms Felipe was screaming, explosion, explosion Then came the sound of alarms Shaking and groaning From below them they heard a great roar And above came the crash of a jet plane exploding While below was still rattling the floor So he led Felipe out before the tower fell Went back down and rescued some more and he went in again and he ran up the stairwell Heard a series of blasts in the core Saving lives made him a ground zero hero He was praised for his bravery NBC sent a film crew to his home for an interview But they didn't put that story on TV Testified to the 9-11 Commission On a truth he would not compromise Then his story like others went the way of omission Cause it contradicted the lies that date World Trade Center worker William Rodriguez was lucky to be coming in late He'd have come in on time He'd have been on the top floors Not a known of explosions down below He was lucky to survive those demolition bombings that murdered 3,000 or so 
lucky to survive those demolition bombings that murdered three thousand or so. Mm. 